Alexia Uera Mupende always dreamed of becoming a fashion model from a very young age. However, seeing mostly blonde white women strutting the runways of Paris and New York, the young model felt discouraged that maybe she didn't fit the criteria until she got her first break in 2001. Uh, I started before, like way back as far as 2001, uh, but there was not that many opportunities, so I kind of put it on hold. But then I decided to just go out and look for it. Some things you have to go and find <laughs> if you really love it. It was in 2012 that she decided to return to modeling, which by then the fashion industry had evolved with many young talented designers emerging. But she's also quick to point out that it hasn't been that easy. Well, it's, it's been interesting because everyone's got uh, different things. Some do clothing, some do uh, jewelry, uh, some have done runway, some of me have done photo shoots for, so it, it's a whole variety of everything. But it's, it's been very interesting. It's been challenging because sometimes when you see the final product of a photo shoot, it looks wow, but the whole process in itself is not just uh, plain easy. But it's, it's been very interesting. It's been a, it's been a learning experience. <laughs> Although the market has grown quite significantly in the last few years, as a model there's still not enough work for one to make a living. Which is why Alexia has been looking for other opportunities outside of Rwanda and recently got a chance to model in Dubai. Actually recently I was fortunate enough to represent Rwanda at uh, Runway Dubai uh, in November of 2014. It was uh, an amazing experience, very, very interesting, wonderful exposure, challenging in itself because it's a whole different market, it's, everything is, it's not like what we're used to here, but it was definitely a rewarding experience. Alexia now hopes to get more opportunities outside of Rwanda, which is why she wants to fully dedicate her time to the craft and hopefully turn it into a career. A lot has changed since 2001 to today, but there's not that uh, many opportunities locally in Rwanda at the moment. So I'm planning and hoping that I can travel a lot more, uh, visit different markets, depending on where I can find work, and uh, just explore the whole experience. It's, it's something I want to do with my life. I want to uh, turn it into a career path. So hopefully I'll get to travel overseas to different places, Asia, Europe, uh, America, Wherever, wherever it takes me. They say it's never too late to chase your dreams, and Alexia is a living example of that. Who knows, maybe the next time you see her will be on the big runways of Milan, London, Paris, or New York. Alan Karakire, Rise and Shine, Rwanda.